Warren Kimball is a former war hero and the current president of the new California Republic. His insistence on defending Hoover Dam has kept NCR troops in Nevada for years. He's years. also a dick. We'll make a save here. Have you talked to Fester in this timeline? Uh, no, we have not. Oh. I'll do that off screen. I'm gonna say, yeah, we, you can just do that to, to get the quest off screen. But we now know we need 50. Well, yeah, I told you. Yes, I was getting to that. <laughs> oh, wait, are we recording? Yes. Oh, good. <laughs> I forgot to do our intro, so let's try this again. <laughs> no, we don't gotta do the intro. We can just go on like this. It's it's all good. It's all nobody good, needs, man. Nobody needs intros anymore. No. Ah, no, I didn't want to oh. leave. This isn't the largest place. Yeah, I, I think the best thing you can do here is go to the factory floor and just get a whole bunch of sass sarsaparilla. Yeah. Which you think would have been raided by now, but nope. Apparently, the robots are menu are still producing sunset sarsaparillas and distributing them. Well, that's what they say, but like when you go there, nothing's actually moving. I think. No, we have to wake them up. Huh. Or. Please step into the open and identify yourself. Something happened here. Oh, oh yeah, wow. there was a fight. You bet there is no star bottle caps on there. I know, right? There's got to be some here. I mean, you you think, right? You would think in the like hell, like we could probably even make our own if we wanted to. <laughs> now that would be cheating just a bit. Well, could you imagine if there was just like a machine where they make the star cap, the star bottle caps? I mean, they gotta have one. How else do they make it? Well, logically speaking, you're right. But I'm just saying that if there's a quest to collect 50 of these things, they wouldn't let you just come here and make it yourself. That's true. Or they now, could have had the machine and they required that you needed to have a very high, uh, like, repair skill or something. I just remember to think about this quest. Um, oh, look, I got a your katana. <gasps> cool. And it has the same abilities as our Mantis Fist. I played a New Vegas mod a while ago that had a katana. Yo! It, well, I mean, this is like the coolest thing ever. With search protocol. <laughs> this is just like one of my Japanese animes. Desert Punk. <laughs> uh, What's, your lock pick? What's your lockpick skill at? Is that 75? 75, yeah. Okay. I just need I'm, to drop some. Fuck it, drop it. I'm pretty sure that, uh, <laughs> I'm pretty sure that the room to get into, uh, to get the, to get your reward is lockpick 100. Oh, so so you could either so you could either do the quest to get all the ball caps or have a lockpick skill of 100. Maybe we should just sneak our way in then. Please step into the open. And I mean, <laughs> it might be a bit easier. Or we could be the manliest of men and actually say we did it legitimately. But if it comes down towards it, we might as well just say fuck it. I'm surprised, or... you're, not, I'm surprised you're not experiencing any of those symptoms that Festus uh, mentioned earlier by drinking all those. Man, it's almost like the main character in these type of games is bullshit powered. In a Bethesda game? Oh, no. Seven, four, three, eight, reporting. There seems to be a malfunction with the lights, sir. Wait a minute. You're not my manager. Intruder! Oh. Oh. And who gets to clean up all this blood? Scanning for hostile. Wow, what happened to his life bar? I don't know. That was weird. It was showing that you weren't doing any, uh... Like, like he had the sealed icon. We're getting a shit ton of Sunset Sarsaparilla. Oh my god, your character would be dead if this was real life. I know, right? You would be experiencing every single one of those symptoms. Maza, 
Vomiting. Hallucinations. Halitosis. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the granddaddy of them all. Dang, nothing? Aha, we got one. Oh, hey. Wow, I'm... What was that, like one out of 20? I know, right? And there's more over here. We're at least gonna drop our... Some... We've been grabbing these a lot. They don't do anything. Except for value, but we don't need them. Not them. Where are they? What? They're labeled... Ah, oh, there they are. Fuck off. What were those? Empty Sunset Sesperilla bottles. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No reason to keep them around. Nope. Can't be crafting anything with them. Oh, it'd be neat if you could make cocktails with them. Oh, yeah, that'd be kind of cool. Engaging multiple hostiles. That's nice. Engaging multiple hostiles. There is no escape. <laughs> oh, my God, these boxes are freaking out. Whoa! Whoa, look at them! <laughs> I think I used the force. I think you use the physics sins and more like it's... Luke, use the physics. <laughs> what? Luke, use the physics. Uh, look, Ben, I don't think that's a good idea. J just use the physics. Look, just look, just, just, just waggle something around until <laughs> things break. Oh man, I miss being able to do that. You can't do that in 76. I hit something! <laughs> I know, and that's sad. Yeah, all the all the items are just placed in the plastic bags. Wah, wah. Good thing we're not playing hard car mode, otherwise that ammo would make me want to shit bricks because I would have to cart it around. And it would be so heavy. Yeah, the uh Fuel and rockets. Those are those are the big one. Empty. Oh man, there's not even any star bottle caps in the uh, manager's office. You know, I could picture the manager hoarding a bunch of star caps. You know, just being that big of a shithead. Oh, here we go. Then we might find something here. <laughs> well, that was easy. Uh, hey. <laughs> oh, I mean, a star cap. One. He had one. Hey, that's more than what we had. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, there's only one left. Well, there's two left. I saw that one here, at least. Where... Uh, it's seventh, seventh, sixth or seventh line on the left. Up. There it is. That one. Oh, and didn't give you an extra. Oh, oh no. Ah. Oh, oh, come on. So it has to be fast. Aha. Because I already picked lose. <laughs> Wait, what's this? What contest? Sir, the rumors of some sort of contest are quickly growing out of control. We're getting flooded with calls and messages asking if it's true we're redeeming bottle caps for prizes. Do you want me to make an official statement denouncing this rumor? I think that new toy thing is uh, maybe referencing to the prize. Oh. Oh, yay. Unspent Desperilla. Nothing. Uh, how many do we have now? 24. We're almost um, halfway there. Yeah, almost halfway there. That's, uh... But odds are we might just pick the damn lock. I can't believe your, your character took a sip from his, uh... From his, like, Vault 13 canister. After he's drinking so much census... Sunset Sarsaparilla. Well, you see, it's like he drinks the stuff, but it's not actually quenching his thirst. In fact, I think in hardcore mode, Sunset Sarsaparilla makes your thirst worse. 
No way. Hold on, check the check the factory line. Aren't there bottle caps on here? Aren't there? Doesn't one of these have bottle caps? I don't know, but I'm trying to find this one robot that's supposed to help us with um sorting through all this stuff. But I can't seem to find him. Oh, there he is, Mr. Oh. Janitor. Ah. Maybe we can wake him up remotely. Well, that was easy. Which doesn't make any sense for this type of technology that they have. I know, right? What mail we got? Water leak. Just great so you know. Job. Water damage. And great job. I wanted Shady, to personally you congratulate you on the process of the new automated janitorial system. In particular, number 135 has proven very popular with the staff. I can't tell you how many complaints I used to hear about stray bottle caps getting into the machinery. Oh, and we should have a meeting soon, considering the rest of your staff. How was your Tuesday? Yeah, considering they're about to fire them. And then he... I, I think he unloads them into this bin here. So we're going to give him back those empty sunset bottles we took. Just so we could have an empty trash can here. So when he um, empties it, we'll see what we got. Can you wait? Can you like do a can you like make time pass? Uh I think we have to let it happen normally. What? I can try. Oh. It's amazing how much dust collects if you leave things alone even for a short while. Yeah, he's For off. You hundred years. There's enemies nearby. Where? I bet there's some rad roses somewhere. Probably. Oh, they're over here. Uh. Let's see, sixty-three, and twelve. Oh. Yeah. Engaging. Oh. Oh, jeez. Sorry, but this wins. Oh. oh, yeah, this is a Grimsome Caravan quest thingy here. Alright. Time to level up. Already. <laughs> Let's get that to 90 at least. Yeah. And then repair. I think that would be best. Now this... The Mantis Fist that you have, that doesn't count towards unarmed, does it? I think it does. Oh, boy. And you're still doing that much damage with only 20 unarmed. And a lot of luck. Because it oh, boosts yeah. my critical damage and stuff. Oh, um, yeah, that's that's right. Something about the robots, I guess. Experimental robots! All right, I'm pretty sure he's done by now. Yeah, because odds are these are just going to be empty. A lot of these are just like, hey, we got new robots. Let's fire our staff. I know, right? Oh, no. The, oh, no. The robots weren't as easy to manage as we thought. Oh, he must have thrown them out somewhere else then. So, you know what? Who cares? No, I remember what you're talking about. I just, yeah, I, I don't know how long it takes him. Talk to him. I'm just going to follow him. Push him along. Moving right along. Moving right along. Oh god! Oh my god. What did I do? What happened? The physics are just breaking apart reality as we speak. Well, let's disturb the reality more. Anarchy! I demand anarchy! Fall! I command you! You bastards! They are, just, they are just jiggling around, waiting to burst free. Oh, you're waiting for an excuse, huh? Looks like, don't you have a grenade launcher? Oh boy, here we go. Nothing? Oh. Oh, I got those boxes. <laughs> God, those boxes are alright. I call it art. Alright, I think we've wasted enough time here. 
Are you done? Can't you at least, can't you at least throw those shutters? I think so. I think you can. Yes, you can. Yep. All right. Where should we go next? I don't know. Where'd you, uh, where'd, you, where'd you got planned? Let's see. We have the talent pool. We can just do real quick. Yeah, let's do that. We only have two more anyway. We need to go... Here. Il Dorado. The magnificent and golden 1,000 years ago. Oh boy. Oh, I think we got legionnaires. Uh, try, trying to hunt you down? It's either them or it's Cazadors. But judging by the shadows in the distance, that's Cazadors. I'm gonna run away from that. I don't fuck with them. I try not yeah. to. Yeah, I'd rather deal with a hundred legions than a couple of Cazadors any day. Howdy. Howdy. Well, howdy, partner. This is your old pal, Festus. <laughs> I'm just chilling out here with old Victor, talking about the good old days. Oh, yeah, this is that dried up lake that uh, has a bunch of ants on it. Yeah. Them. It's them. Hey, this is, uh, I think this is, this is the place. This is where I was talking about. This is the place that, with the billboard with the guy. Yep. Who, uh... Who's probably, like, his father is probably the mysterious stranger. Yeah. And I think our barter skill is high the enough. Leader. Howdy there, partner. Howdy! What's your story, stranger? My story's a long one, friend, and I can't say as it's all that interesting. Nevertheless, I'm interested. Well, I was born in a little town out Montana way. Me and Ma didn't have much ever since my pa up and left. Your father abandoned you? That he did. Never did know why. Ma always said he was a real mysterious fella, even when yep, he was Yep, yep, that's him. it. <laughs> he was a stranger <laughs> sometimes. Yep, mysterious and stranger. Uh, that's, uh, that's that's the big one. Sounds like you miss him. Is that why you're wandering? Maybe. Maybe I just never felt like I belonged back home. It must have been hard. It sure wasn't easy. Ma worked her fingers to the bone to make sure we had enough to survive. And I worked the coal mines from when I was 15. After Ma died, the coal I, mines. I wanted to find my pa and get some answers from him. Been out here looking ever since, but he ain't an easy man to find. Maybe if I activate vats around you, he might show up. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Could you imagine if the lo you could get the Lonesome dr Drifter as like a partner, like Boone or something, and then like the mysterious stranger shows up in your perk and he could have been like, Paul? And then he, like, vanishes. You know, like, that hidden dialogue. That would be interesting. What will you do? Can't say as I really know. Maybe I'll just ask him why. Maybe I'll punch him right in the mouth. Hell, the more I talk about it, the more the whole damn thing sounds like a dumb idea. Sounds like you just have to move on. Settle down, maybe. Maybe I should. Don't suppose you know any place a fellow with a guitar might find a job, huh? Actually, I do. Well, hmm. Indeed, I do. Maybe it's time to give these tired old bones a rest. All right, show me what you've got. Tired old bones? I'm only 21. Show me what you got. I'm giving you a real opportunity here. How about some compensation? I suppose it's only right you get a little something for your troubles. Here, my daddy left me this gun. Guess I don't need it no more. <laughs> yes. One of my favorite guns in the game. And here's why. Listen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> in case it wasn't obvious. Like, oh. Gee, I wonder who his father is. <laughs> oh, and when we're done. Yep. <laughs> yeah. I that's love a good that's a cool gun. It is. It's just really cool. Gonna have to level up my gun though, but it's worth it. Like the Mantis King can stay as is because it can just
coax off of my luck stats and all that. All right. It's over. I take that bet. Oh, okay. Aww. <laughs> Who would have guessed? Hey, I could have hit. Love that gun. Alright, you know what? Maybe we should sell some things and actually buy more guns. Let's sell some of these plasma stuff and whatnots. At least the plasma mine. Uh, the plasma mines, at least. I'll keep the grenades. Uh, I, so don't I thought you wanted to, 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 to keep your plasma stuff. Yeah, but I don't really do mines in this game. A mine! The only time that I find mines are, are useful well, is, is if you're being that. chased by, you uh, by the grass scorpions. I find them a little bit more useful when I'm running from death claws. <laughs> oh yeah, or, or death claws. Like, or like any animals that chase you. Transaction. But maybe with the Mantis King we can actually kill them. Let's see. We... what? I kind of want to get this. But maybe the GRA version. Yeah, let's do it. What's what's the difference? I think the Gunrunner Arsenal ones have a little bit more to them, or I don't know. More what? I don't know, but uh, Condition? or maybe the fact that these are the ones that can be modified. Oh, could be. Point is, they're both the same anyway, so might as well, right? If they're the same price, why argue over it? Uh, mines. Oh, you can buy that. Uh, do you really want to keep around a like a pistol and rifle? Because they both use the same ammo. No, they don't. Wait, they don't? Energy cell, oh. microfusion cells. We're all good. Oh, okay. I'll sell the katana. It was fun. We're keeping the Mantis King. Alright, what other weapons? Apparently, this is a really good weapon. Yeah, but the problem is that because it's an assault rifle, you go through ammo really fast. Yeah. And I just, I didn't... Bozar! You know, what the heck? Yeah, I just find that in these types of games, it's better to go for uh, quality over quantity. <laughs> the Gehenna. Uh, Alright, I think we're good... Riot shot. Ooh. No, I think that one's really good. I kind of want that just for the fact that I like it. What what shotgun do you do you not have a shotgun? No. So let's grab it and then let's sell stuff. We'll give him one plasma rifle. We don't need one. We don't need two right now. Uh, what else? Uh, we'll sell that. Keep that because that's a quest item actually. Oh. Uh, let's sell some ammo we don't use. Uh, .38. I don't think we need any. It's for a hunting rifle, right? Okay, no, we don't. So we can sell that. We can sell mm -hmm. that. Keep these. Sell that. Sell this. Yeah. It takes 12 ml, so we sell these. Okay, yeah. I don't know if I have anything for this, but I think Boone's gun. No, his gun takes point thirty eight. So you can you can sell the five the five millimeter. Yeah. Oh, that's that's nothing. You don't get anything for that. There's no point in selling then. This I can definitely sell. That I can definitely sell. And flamer fuel can go, and so can yep. the missiles. There okay. we go. Yeah. Get rid of those. And then we'll buy. Some ammo it needs, like that. And we'll get some 50s. And we'll stop there for now. Alright. Let's take a look at them. A pretty good shopping spree going on. Mm -hmm. Requirement strength of 8. I only have a 1. <laughs> That's alright, we'll make uh... It's like you shoot. Okay, if you shoot the gun, are what? you gonna go flying back? Because you can't handle it. Ooh. 
I definitely not good with guns. <laughs> My guns is very abysmal. Yeah, it's only it's a ten. <laughs> Oops, <laughs> but that's okay. But let's look at, take a look at the riot shotgun. Whoa! Holy hell! This is this is a good one. I'm keeping this. Yeah, it's got, it's got the barrel clip and everything. Yeah. All right, so I think the next thing we should focus on as well is guns. Yeah. Probably best to get the guns up, because, you know, considering that's your main form of attack in this game. Yeah, barter's fine. I don't think we need to do anything more with barters. This, we can at least try to get up to, like, 75 or so. We still got DLC. Trust me, once we reach level 20, we're he definitely going to one of the DLCs. And we're level 19, so all we need to do is some side questing. I'll set through one DLC. I don't want to do all of them. That's a bit much. If we're if that's the case, then maybe we can do Lonely Mount. Uh, oh, sorry, Lonesome Road together. Lonesome, Lonesome Road. I like Lonesome Road. I'll I'll sit through. I'll go through that one. That oh. is, that's probably that's probably my, my my favorite one. Yeah, and when I reach level twenty, I'm gonna head to Big Mountain then, or Blue Mountain or whatever it's called. I keep forgetting its name, but it's my favorite DLC. That's definitely my my top. It's it's definitely close between, uh, the the. Yeah, I don't remember it. it was, it's a mountain one, whatever. But uh, let's finish up this quest. Yeah. Let's head to Novak and get the last person. And honestly, I don't blame you for not wanting to sit through the canyon one because that one's gonna be bad. Even I'll, with I'll the tell you, I'll, perk. I'll tell you what. We can do the. Uh, we can do the. Uh, the, the canyon one, Eden. if you figure out how to do it in like five seconds. <laughs> there is a speedrun route that goes into that DLC, kills a guy who steals your map, and then you can leave right away. Yep, I know that trick. Hell, I joined the Legion, and I found um, Abraham or the Burn Man or whatever his name Joshua, that's his name. And I'm just like, you know what, I'm done. And I just <laughs> murdered him and his entire <laughs> entourage. I think it's even faster than that. I think, like, you know, when you first get there, somebody steals your map, and that's why you can't leave. Oh. But, like, you can, kill, you can kill that guy, get your map back, and then leave, and it takes, like, a minute. I'm going to eat this food. I don't use this food. There we go. What's my rads at, by the way? Oh. Yeah, the, the, the foods Problem are... Solved. Yeah, food is pretty good but you know when there's stim packs why do you need why do you need to eat i know right all right i believe he's on the second floor listen to that sound if the ncr ain't got to worry about caesar no more it should worry about improving the lives of regular folks around here since we're not paying taxes we deserve all this free shit right <laughs> There goes Grandma just sitting on the porch spouting off nonsense. Oh, <laughs> uh, please don't kill me. <laughs> Wait. You, uh, you don't for Mr. Bishop, do you? No. Uh, <laughs> sorry, it's just you look like his type, you know. You got that He usually hires NCR to beat up people. So apparently this Mr. Bishop beats up people with NCR powered armored rangers. I don't think they took that into account. <laughs> Aren't you that singer from New Reno? I think I saw you play the clubs there. Oh, so you have heard of me. Yeah, that's right. Uh, I was the big draw at the Shark Club. People used to pay hundreds of caps to see me. If you're looking for work as a singer... Really? The tops, huh? Well, it's no Shark Club, but I hear security on the strip is real tight. Even Mr. Bishop wouldn't hit a joint like that. I'll check it out. Thanks. All right. You know what? Uh, goodbye. I think he's here because he stole caps from Mr. Bishop. Mm. All right. Let's turn in our quest. All right. Only uh, helping out this casino because that's what we're doing. 
See, we I have think... to go to casino, spend all our money, watch all that money disappear. A casinoopolis. That poor dead body, he just doesn't get a break. Thank you for visiting New Vegas. Oh, oh God, God, he's even more mutilated than I think. Yeah, because people come in and out and just, they're just stepping on him. All day, I every like to, day. I like to imagine the Securitrons just going back and forth between, like, patrol duties and they're just running it over with his wheel. It just has, like, tons of, like, tire tracks on it. Yeah, like a Looney Tune skit when, like, Elmer Fudd exactly. or something gets hit with a car. Or Wiley Coyote in this case. That makes more sense. Now, I'm wondering, after we do this, should we hit up one of the casinos and do their quest line? Which one? I'm thinking maybe if our speech is good enough, which it is, I'm thinking maybe the White Glove Society? Oh, yeah, them. The completely normal people, definitely. Oh, yeah, super normal. The people who will be happy to have you over for dinner. But uh, in order to make sure that we do it right, I think we have to take a quest before we go into the place. Oh, because like you like you like like kind of like, uh, find a missing person. Yeah, because I think Mortimer won't let us in on the quest because we're too goody goody. Oh. Hey, hey! Welcome, welcome, welcome to the finest entertainment experience in New Vegas. My name is Tommy Torini, and how can I make your day? Tommy Tortellini. Let's talk about the act I recruited. The cowboy act. Yeah, he dropped on in here not too long before you. He's got chops, baby, real chops. And I ain't just talking about that mustache. And like we agreed, here's your fee. 5% of the cut comes to 166 caps. Don't spend them all in one place now. <laughs> unless it's right here. Sneezies. That's the, let's talk about the recruits. You talking about Mr. Isaac? Damn, baby, when you bring them in, you bring them in. That cat's gonna bring me money like you wouldn't believe. Here's your 5%, baby. You enjoy that. That comedian, you mean? Yeah. He was a hell of a haggler. Cost me a pretty cap. Hope he's worth it. Here's your 5%. That ugly mug with the razor tongue? <laughs> Take it, baby. He'll be one hell of a novelty act, just like Tommy promised. Here's your 5%. Alright, that should be everything. You know it, baby. Alright, goodbye. Take it easy, baby. We are now accepted by the strip. What does that even mean? We're accepted. They like us. They don't just tolerate us. They kind of like us. The strip as a whole? Yeah. Ugh, fine. I guess you can be our little pog champ. Can't say that on Twitch. All right, I'm, I'm, I'm out of here. <laughs> no, come back! <laughs> oh. All right, I'm back. Oh, okay. I can't believe you, can't believe you said that. <laughs> Howdy, son. How can I help you? But make it quick. Goddamn heat's worse in this town than in the middle of a Brahmin herd at noon. Is that right? You look more than just too hot. What's the matter? Sharp eyes on you, all right. We've gone through a heap of trouble to get in town. Ethel says I just need to... Oh, my God, a heap. A oh, jeez. Nonsense. Oh, oh humble humble. to settle a score. We didn't come a long ways just to stroll our best clothes around. What's this about settling a score? There's a long list of grievances that Heck Gunderson's got to answer for, kid. Gunderson sure House! Rancher stops stealing Gunhammer. If he ain't chiseling behind your back, he just sends his men ready for a fight. Then you either sell your ranch for a penny, or you're dead. I'm tired of being trampled over, kid. And I got a good mind to stop Heck once and for all. What do you plan? I have no illusions that he'll ever stop his plundering, so I'm just going to make him suffer. That's what I'm going to do. Here in town, he's got a few of his armed men to protect him. I just got to find out what he's up to, and then I'll know where to hit him hard. Hit him hard, him fast. I oh, might no. Be able, I might be able to help you. Where I come from, we appreciate good intentions. 
I reckon you could help me figure out what he's doing in town. Can't get Tell that barter what, high that enough. Chisler's blowing hmm. hot air over at that there fancy casino, the Ultra Lux. Find out what's his story here, will you? Okay. All right, kid. I appreciate it. I hope to see you soon. All right, we're actually gonna have them wait here. Hey, I'll see. Let's go see what this is about. Looking to lose a few caps, huh? Here, Boone, you just stand in the middle of the desert heat and inside the middle of uh, the strip. Joke's on you. My suit is air conditioned. Yeah, but Boone's isn't. <laughs> His beret protects him. It gives him plus 10 sun resistance. Yes. Beg your pardon, but could I trouble you to turn over your weapons? Wow, I can hear you in this mask better than I can hear people in actual masks. My deepest apologies for the slightest inconvenience. Slightest! You have my assurance that everything will be returned upon your departure. But we simply can't have any... Does this mask have a hole in it? Like, where, for his mouth? It's not I the think the lips have a slit in them. Uh, Please, enjoy your stay. Yes, yes, goodbye. Adieu. I do you a favor. Things are getting stranger every day. Hello, Mr. Gunderson. Beg your pardon, stranger, but I'm looking for someone. You ain't seen a young man with dark brown hair and a white hat on lately, have you? No, I haven't. <sighs> ain't nobody got one darn piece of news about my boy. Not one lousy speck of information. Ain't got one Brahmin unaccounted for across a dozen ranches. But I'm here for an hour, and my own son just up and disappears on me. You lost your son? My boy, Ted. He was right here. I didn't leave him but a minute. I told him to stay put while I talked some things over with the white club folks. He was never one to stay tied down to a spot, though. Gets that from his mother. Got most of my staff out looking for him now. I'd be out myself, but I keep hoping he'll show up back here. Of course, if he does that, I'll whoop him till his skinny hide turns to leather for putting me through this. But that don't mean I wouldn't be grateful. Uh, let me help you find your son. Totally. I'd be more than happy to have you. Heck, I'll hire anybody with a pair of legs and at least one good eye at this point. There'd be a lot of money in it for you if you can get him Beyond back to Beyond the safe. beef. <laughs> and if he ain't, you can bet I'll pay for the names of the sons of bitches responsible. Okay, goodbye. Thanks for the quest. Let's go tell him. Now we gotta wait while you are, uh, while it tells you every single piece of item that you have is given back to you. Yup. Come on, Bethesda. Really? Howdy. Good seeing you again. About our deal. I hear you. What's on your mind? Heck's looking for his disappeared son. I'll be damned. You mean the young Gunderson? That's a shaved tail if I ever saw one. He's got less sense than a Brahmin at a crossroads. I'd not be one to complain if he got lost for good, kid. If it makes Hex suffer, then I'm all for it. <laughs> He's barely protected. So Ted's nowhere to be found, and Hex quite unprotected while looking for him, huh? Hell, it sounds like the perfect time to get even. Heck won't know what hit him. What do you say? Hmm. Let's talk prices. I hear you. What's on your mind? Aww. Aww. Dang it. I'll take care of him. Ethel's gonna be madder than a wet hen. But you reap what you sow, kid. And Hex earned every ounce of misery he gets. So we have a deal? Yeah, I consider it done. All right, kid. Be good. I still can't get over the fact that his name is actually Heck. I, I think I, I keep thinking that it's like they're like censoring themselves, but it's like, oh wait, that's 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 just the guy's name apparently. Well, you know what happens in Heck when you deal with the devil. I'll send you to Heck. Hi, hi, I'm Heck. Your pardon, but. Yep, yep, yep. There you go. Goodbye. Those fiend junkies over at Vault Three have been taking some hits. 
I say kill them all. They're all dead. Tell me good news. Uh. Well, you're just gonna kill them now? Oh yeah, we ha- No, 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 we're not gonna do that. Why get our hands dirty when we can make someone else do it? Oh. And then hopefully we can convince him to let us partake of the quest. How may I be of service, sir? Uh, do you have any work? No. Yeah, unfortunately. My, such a popular question. I suppose it is only natural to see us and wonder what it is that makes us special. The White Glove Society has only just made itself known to the public, of course. But our pedigree was established over generations. Were we always so refined? <laughs> I'd be lying if I said yes. But I've always felt we were destined for a place atop modern society. And now, here we are. Not everyone can wear the finest clothes and eat the finest foods, obviously. That's just the reality we live in. But surely we can agree that the most tasteful, sophisticated people are the most deserving. And that's what the White Glove Society is all about. Okay. God, these, God, these guys are just so creepy. Uh, quests, uh... I guess we're doing this the other way. Oh, well. Instead of joining them, I guess we're exposing them. Yeah, I gotta go save the son in the meat locker. Oh, well. Hello, Marjorie. Um. Uh. Oh, she's a mute. I get it. Okay. No, no, no. Completely intentional. And completely intentional. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There was an investigator, huh? For the last time, the White Cliff Society's never. No, I'm not gonna do it. It's written in the charter. Wait, used to eat human flesh? Maybe with that information, we can finally talk to him. Why would she even say that? Like, why would she ever mention that? Oh, yeah, by the way, we used to eat him in flesh. Oh, but we don't do it anymore. Oh, I tried to lie, but... They didn't like that. Didn't like me trying to lie. What happened to mages when we lie? How do you how do you go find the how do you find the kid? Uh oh. Gotta sneak in to find him. I think we need to pickpocket either we need either pickpocket or we just need a high enough lockpick to get down there. I'm thinking it shouldn't be one hundred. You should be fine. Yeah, uh, however, think, if uh, the game will load. I think it actually crashed. I'm thinking it crashed too. Well, I guess we're doing the like White Glove Society in the next episode then. Not the longest video, but okay.